Hello everyone welcome to back my channel I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Ina's speech at the 2024 Republican National Convention on Tuesday, July 16th, Savannah Crisley discussed her parents, Todd and Julie Crisley, who were incarcerated. The podcast presenter stated, we have been consumed with a different kind of drama. As the 26-year-old Chisley Knows Best alumna approached the podium at the Milwaukee event, she initiated her speech by uttering the numbers 7260019 and 7260019. These may be mere numbers to you, but they are the entirety of my being. These are the identification numbers of my parents in the federal penitentiary system, she continued, my name is Savannah Crisley, and you may have observed my family on television. However, for the past decade, we have been preoccupied with a distinct form of drama. In August 2019, a federal grand jury indicted Todd and Julie on 12 counts of conspiracy, tax evasion, and bank and wire fraud. They have denied the allegations and were acquitted of their state tax evasion charge in Georgia. In November 2022, they were combined to serve a 19-year prison sentence after being convicted in a federal court in October 2019. The couple's sentences were reduced by nearly two years months after they reported to prison in January 2023. Julie's seven-year prison sentence was vacated in June, and a resentencing was ordered after federal justices determined that her case lacked sufficient evidence, after Savannah contemplated the legal proceedings and informed the audience that my parents were sentenced to a combined 19 years, the audience hissed. I know, and let me tell you, I got custody, of, my brother, Grayson, now 18, and sister, Chloe, now 11, 10 and 16 at the time, she explained further. And you don't know heartache until you look two children in the eyes and say, I don't know when mom and dad are coming home. Savannah reflected on the day Grayson and Chloe formally moved into her home during the July 16th episode of her podcast, Unlocked. Chloe's room is like a disaster because we're just trying to move everything in, and I had to find them clothes to go and visit, Todd and Julie, that weekend, and I just broke down, according to her. I collapsed to the floor in her bedroom and immediately began to weep. I was like, I am not my mother. I am uncertain about how I will accomplish this, Savannah stated that she had the fortitude to just do it and get up, stating, that's strength. Upon reflection, I am struck by the enormity of the situation. Similar to transitioning from a family without children to one that does, I would not inflict this upon anyone, particularly a preteen girl. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our America People News YouTube channel for more update news.